What is the crack lads? We are back with another video on PES 2013. Um, we're going to be taking a look before we start Math League. We're going to be taking a look at something that's been requested for me. We're going to do a top 50 players or maybe top 40 players um, that were in PES 2013. All right, lads, so we are in Master League and we are about to take a look at the top 50 players. So the top 50 players, we're going to start us off with Wesley Schneider, who is 88 overall. Um, 95 passing, 93 long passing, 95 plays kicking, um, 28 years of age, and he could play all these positions as well. Moving on to number 49, we have got Sirigu. So this guy was obviously playing for PSG at the time. But Sirigu is 88 overall as well, number 49. Next up, we have got Man City's maestro, David Silva, who is 88 overall as well. Uh, B technique, B speed. Very, very fast player actually in this game for, for what his actual stats are. 84 top speed and explosive power 94. Um, again, very, very good player. Robinho for AC Milan. Mad to think that Robinho is actually older than Silva. Robinho has been one of the best players in Pez for years. And in PES 2013, he was probably waning a little bit, but AC Milan had didn't have the best squad. It was a couple of years back. They'd lost Kaka, obviously, um, to Real Madrid. Next up, we have got the Bruza, the Destroyer, the Enforza. Don't know why I'm talking like that. We've got Pepe. He is an absolute beastless. Pepe's kind of intimidating me. Just look, don't look at me like that, Pepe. Don't you dare look at me like that. Those eyes, man, they're just piercing my soul. Marquisio, I always remember this guy. He kind of went into a bit of obscurity. But this guy was an absolute beast central midfield. Next up, we have got Philip Lamb, who was uh, near the end of his career, actually, for Bayern Munich. He had about three or four more years left. We have got Krasic, who is a Serbian player for Juventus. I don't really remember Krasic too much, actually, lads. I don't remember if anyone can educate me on him. He was number 43. Joe Hart makes up number 42, obviously still playing at the moment. We had Sebastian Frey, I think his first name was Sebastian anyway, that's what I've christened him. We had Ashley Cole, number 40. Ashley Cole, again, near the end of his kind of career um, where he was with Chelsea. He had another couple of years left in him, but he was always one of the best players to buy. I mean, him and Zanetti and Philip Lamb were always kind of the fullbacks that I would have used. Uh, we have Arteta, who is number 39 on this list of top players. 30 years of age, he was a free agent in this uh, because I obviously picked Arsenal as my team. Um, so he is going to be a free agent in this. Um, but yeah, we could buy him if we wanted to, but this isn't going to be the Master League that we pick. Um, Aguero, so Sergio Aguero, 38, 23 years of age, was one of the best players in PES 2013, lads. Was an absolute monster. Him and Torres were just incredible up front and Pato. Victor Valdez, part of that incredible Barcelona team. He comes in at number 37. He's joined by Manchester City's Colo Toro. Colo, Colo Torre. Yaya must be here as well soon. Schweinsteiger, one of the best players in PES 2013. 89 overall, number 35 on the list. Next up, we have got Ronaldinho, who's playing with Atletico Mineiro. And this is just, his powers were waning. He still had the technique, but his pace and stuff had kind of dropped off a bit. And lads, I'm going to give you a little hint. I think we could be putting a sneaky cheeky bid in for Ronaldinho when we start our Master League. I think we could because I would love to have him attack in midfield. I'd love to play with him. Next up, we've got Peekers. PK number 33 on the list. We're getting into the top 30 now, lads. So bear with us. 89 overall. Absolute unit at the back. Next up, we have got Modric, who is still playing at Tottenham Hotspur. Next up, we've got Stevie G. Again, coming to the end of his career. He had another couple of seasons in him. Um, but again, as, a, as an older type player, you know, after a season or two of Master League, um, he was going to be replaced. But absolutely incredible in my club or in Master League Online. Gareth Bale, another one of these guys just starting his career proper, was just after bursting onto the scene for the last year or two with Spurs. And um, yeah, he was about to get his move to Real Madrid, obviously, but a brilliant player as well in it and just really, really fast. Petr Cech, number 29, he still has the, the, the head, headgear on. And in fairness, lads, his face, and his, he actually looks very like the legend that they released um, for eFootball a couple of days ago. 30 years of age as well. Forgot that Czech was actually that tall, 197. Next up, we've got his Chelsea teammate, John Terry, number 28 on the list. Wayne Rooney, 26 years of age, in the peak of his powers. Absolutely incredible. I think pretty much everyone had him in Master League or in Master League Online. 
because he could play so many different positions. Look at this. He could play anywhere up front or on the left or the right. Next up, we've got Nani, who is rated the same as Rooney, a 90 rating. Now we're into the top 25, lads. We have got Lucio. Next up, we've got Vincent Company, who was only 26 in PES 2013. Aramiro, this was kind of a hidden gem, I remember, in Master League Online. Uh, everyone had him. Everyone had him. Like, look at the stats. He had 91 top speed, 90 stamina. Next up, we've got Vidic, number 22, on the list. We've got Nemanja Vidic, again, in the peak of his powers, lads, 30 years of age. Manuel Neuer, 26 years of age. Looks pretty decent. Looks like an absolute monster. He's been hitting gym, bursting out of the top. He was number 21. And number 20 is Julio Caesar. So we're into the top 20. Next up, we've got Handanovic, who I think is still playing at the moment. Correct me if I'm wrong. He was 91 overall, so he shared that rating with Neuer and Cesar. Number 18 on the top 50 list. Italian beast, Juventus beast. One of the best centre-backs of all time, I would have to say. Like, just unbelievable player. And Cassius, I think Cassius was also one of the best keepers in the game. You had four or five keepers that were around 91 overall. Pirlo, so we got Pirlo with a lovely face here. And Pirlo is obviously 33, coming to the end of that career. Now, he still had a couple of seasons left in him, lads, you know. Ibrahimovic, was he rated like 96 or 7 one year, if I do remember correctly? But Ibra, yeah, 29 years of age with Paris Saint-Germain. Um, he was really, really good, obviously. 96 body balance, 95 kicking power, and 90, or 88 shot accuracy. The Rossi, again, a lot of people had him. I remember my younger brother... He loved De Rossi as a rock, as an anchorman. But Ari and Robin, I've seen calls for Robin to be brought back as a legend, lads. I would love Robin to be brought back as a legend for real or for Bayern Munich. Next up, we've got Piol. Piol, who's number 12 on the list. He's still back in Dream Team at the moment. He's on my Dream Team Chronicle squad. Absolute monster, man. The hair, though. The hair needs to go, Piol. We might have to change that if we do sign you, if we do go, into, go for you. And of course, Buffon, who looks like an absolute boss. He is 93 overall. I think the highest rated keeper that we have on this top 50 list for PES 2013. Look at the stats, man. 98 goalkeeping skills, 94 responsiveness, and uh, body balance and all that is really good as well. Thought his teamwork could be a little bit higher, but that's more for kind of CMFs. Mike Connor, Macon. Obviously, we remember Garrett Bale absolutely rinsing him uh, when Bale was at the peak of his powers, but. Yeah, this guy was incredible. I think a lot of people had him in Master League Online as well. And you can see why with the stats. Next up, we've got Danny Alves, who was probably the second best um, or third best player in the game for me when I had the game, when I was playing it regularly. 29 years of age. Obviously, Macon was a little bit older, um, or Mycon. But Danny Alves had it all, man. He could just do everything. And the stamina, you could just keep him running all day. God help the wife, because he just doesn't know when to stop. Genuinely. Uh, Xabi Alonso, 30 years of age, was just after joining Real Madrid, I think the season before, I think it was the season before, maybe two seasons before, I'm not too sure, correct me if I'm wrong lads, his passing was some of the best in the game, and it's mad to think that Xabi Alonso was rated in PES 2013 as the 8th best player in the game, that is a bit mad, even though he was incredible, Ribéry, obviously the two pronged attack of Ribéry and Robin, Bayern Munich were one of the best teams in the game for wingers, like, he was 95 overall, man. The same as Alonso. Like, just ridiculous. Not as fast as Robin, but he had the better stats and he could play in more positions. Next up, we have got Cesc Fabregas, which, believe it or not, was actually rated 95 overall after leaving Arsenal and going to Barcelona. His stats were incredible. His teamwork stat was amazing. He brought the best out of his team. Next up, we're into the top five, lads. Thiago Silva. Would you put a bet on Thiago Silva? I think you guys would have been naming who could be top five. Who's missing? Obviously, we know Messi and Ronaldo are going to be there, but who else was going to be there? Thiago Silva is a bit of a surprise one, but this guy, I don't think people realize how actually good he was for PSG in those seasons. Now, he was a bit overhyped in terms of the ratings and stuff. Maybe he shouldn't have been above like a 94 rating, but um, fence 95, 90 top speed. He was just incredible. He was so fast, so strong, so powerful. A little bit short for a CB, but you could just put a giant beside him and that would have sorted that problem. Top four, we've got Xavi. So Barcelona have got Xavi in here as well. They've got a couple in the top 10, um, including, you know, obviously uh, Xavi and Piol. And uh, then it's kind of split between Dani Alves as well, who's there. Um, 32 years of age, Xavi was coming to the end of his career at Barcelona. You get a couple of seasons out of him in Master League, but for Master League Online, he was the creme de la crop. Next up, we've got Cristiano Ronaldo, who's 97 and shares that rating with Xavi. 
what can I say about Ronaldo, lads? I mean, he was just the main man in this game. You know, he's been, I reckon, Ronaldo, taking Adriana out of it, right? This is an interesting question to ask you guys. I personally think that Ronaldo has been the best Pez player ever in game. And I would even go as far as to say as, yeah, he's probably been the best Pez player individually. I would say that Roberto Carlos, I would say Ibrahimovic, Adriano, uh, Van der Merch, and Ronaldo have been the best, like, bona fide best five players maybe in the game. But let me know your selection, lads. I think Ronaldo has been the overall best ever uh, in the game. But he was only rated at 97, even though he was the poster boy, which is very, very, very interesting and a very brave move from Konami. So who's top two? Who's top two, lads? Iniesta is number two. That was a bit of a strange choice. They all have the same rating. You know what I mean? They all have the same rating. So you've got Xavi, Iniesta, and Ronaldo. And in fairness, that Barcelona team, lads, were incredible for the last couple of seasons before PES 2013 came out. So you kind of had to really reward that. You have Iniesta at number two. You have Xavi number four. You have got Cesc at number six. You have Dani Alves at number nine. You got Piol at number 12. Ridiculous. Like, they just had an unbelievable stacked team. So if Iniesta is number two, that means that it is the main man, Messi, who is a 90, 98 rating by himself, standing out by himself. He is the man with the plan. 98 overall. Look at those stats. Absolutely incredible. Interesting enough, if you were to buy Messi, he'd be 34 million. If you were to buy Ronaldo, he'd be 30. So obviously Ronaldo's 26, Messi's 25. So that year younger adds to that. But again, Messi. 99 attack, 98 dribble accuracy, 99 shot accuracy, 99 explosive power, 98 dribble speed, and 83 teamwork. Ronaldo's teamwork lets his rating down, I think, a little bit. But I still, I'm thinking, I'm taking Ronaldo. Let's 95 top speed, 97 kick and power, 95 shot accuracy, 91 explosive power, and dribble speed, 97. So, yeah, they're very similar style players. Um, Iniesta, obviously, is just ridiculous stats as well. Absolutely incredible stats. Like, Xavi has 98 teamwork like Iniesta has got 97 so yeah that is it lads for the top 50 um just to give you a recap there of the top 10 Messi, Iniesta, Ronaldo, Xavi, Silva, Fabregas, Ribery, Xavi, Alonso, Alves and Maicon so that is it for the top 50 players in PES 2013 lads it took a bit longer than I assumed but hope you enjoyed it and uh, we'll be back starting our Master League very very soon so watch this space peace let me know your favorite ever player in a PES game I'll talk to you